Hi, I'm Taj Gibson, professional basketball player. I'm here to teach you the fundamentals of defensive rebounding and to understand how important it is to bring on the basketball court if you're looking forward to getting any play in time, looking forward to evaluate your game and get better as time goes on. In the NBA game, guys like myself tend to be real slim. So in the NBA, there's a lot of guys that are real muscular and bulky, such as Shaquille O'Neal or Kendra Perkins. So in the NBA game, I have to be able to meet them first. I have to be able to run up to them and stop them in their tracks and try to contain them from getting the loose ball or defensive rebound. Some, a lot of guys tend to just, just go up one hand and it's not enough. He, see how he just rushed me off and went to the basket? In all kinds of levels, from high school to college to the pros, this is one of the most important things. I learned as a rookie last year, um, uh, my coach always stressed me so much about how it was really, really, really important on defensive rebounding. And I always look forward to just going up against the top guys, just learning these small steps. First thing I'm going to teach you is how to stop him in his tracks. Like even though Justin, is may, he may be shorter than me, but he's, he's muscular. He's, he's real, he real, he's real round um, built. So I have to just run up to him and stop him. For instance, Justin's going to try to attack me. I have to, I'm going to have to meet him. Shoulder first. Bring, this, bring my right foot around and stop him. And wait for the ball to come up. I, I, me, I'm, a, I'm an excellent rebounder because I understand the fundamentals of just stopping a person first and trying to locate the basketball. I use my body, lower body to stop him. As he comes from me, I, I, start, I check him, go around and, and contain him, contain him until that ball comes around. No matter what he does to me, I'm either gonna get a, uh, he's either gonna get a foul call from going over my back or I'm gonna be successful and get the rebound. That's one of the things that's real important to me. I understood, I understand guys are really looking forward to shooting, getting running back and just all the small things. But this is one of the main things in the game. Because the reason why I got so much playing time as a rookie and even as a freshman in college, because I was understanding the fundamentals of rebounding and defensive rebounding. And that's what I made my stake on in college and even now in the pros. We're about to take some shots right now, and then we're going to demonstrate uh, the things that I look forward to doing in the basketball game. And I'm going to walk you along for my steps to trying to get you to be a good rebounder. First things first, I'm going to locate my man ahead of the time. I'm going to tap him, and I'm going to keep tapping him, because when the ball goes up, I'm going to know to, to run quick, to help and meet him quickly, because he's muscular. Guys that are, tender, that are shorter, it doesn't really matter if you're shorter or taller. You can always get out re rebounded in any game. Just using the right fundamentals and um, playing with a lot of strength and heart inside. So as you see, we're going to work it right now. I'm going to keep tapping him. That's, that's one episode right there. See how this, I was able to meet him first? I didn't just, most guys tend to just do this right away. Shoot the ball right now. Just look. And at that time, I'm not going to get the rebound. We never know who's going to get the rebound. In the, in the crucial parts of the game, small plays like this really matter because we really need to get come up with the basketball. You never know. You put her won the state championship, NCAA championship over this one play. So every single play matters on a defensive end. So we're going to do it one more time. Before the shot is made, before the shot goes up, my eyes located on my man. I'm going to tap him. I'm going to keep tapping him, get back. Tap him, get back. As the shot goes up, I'm going to meet him. Watch the shot go up. I bring it down to my chest, and I tuck it with my, I tuck it up with my chin. So when defenders come, they understand I have the possession. There, there won't be any knocking down out of, out of my possession, because I tucked it and I, and I cradled it. I'm Taj Gibson, you just one of my pro tips. We know three basic things, defensive rebounding, staying aggressive, and getting low. Those three things will help you be a strong defensive rebounder. I know in a lot of guys, they may not understand it, but if you want to be better in each and every level that you try to get to, uh, those things are going to be real important. As you saw me, uh, I went from the bottom to the top. You got to keep doing those small things, and uh, the sky's the limit. I'm Taj Gibson signing out.